So police described a night of violence and vandalism overnight. Now the focus for some protesters and business workers turns to cleaning up. NBC 26's Matt Jarko has that side of the story. A broken window. There was a brick thrown. And a broken heart. We're just very sad and heartbroken. Business manager Jill Munster said late last night, a brick went through a store window at Furs and Clothing of Distinction. This is what we're left with. Today, the focus is on cleanup. Munster said the window will get boarded up and new glass will come in. Not something that can be an immediate replacement, but it'll be all set soon. It was a similar scene at several area businesses today. At the Marathon on Walnut Street, we saw broken windows, looted shelves, and people who helped clean up. My friend said he already got three trash bags full. We're going to just keep going. Peaceful protesters from this weekend told us they were angry at what last night became. All the vandalism and the destruction that went on, and it's like, I didn't come out here for that. I didn't bring these people here for that. So for y'all to destroy a small business, that's not sitting well with me. I just, I want to make sure I can help make everything right. And while those businesses and windows could soon be fixed, hearts may not heal quite as quickly. This is not the Green Bay that we know. Matt Jarko, NBC 26.